Last week, OFA reported on the patriarch to the Ricketts family $1 billion fortune, which includes the Chicago Cubs, Joe Ricketts, who was poised to spend $10 million of his own money on race-baiting anti-Obama political ads, after a New York Times article got a copy of a 54-page plan from the firm's strategic perception, but backed out later on after massive backlash and pressure. Joe Ricketts is behind the Super PAC Ending Spending Action Fund, where on their website they say they want to end wasteful government spending and ask you if you think the government spends too much of your money on things we cannot afford and do not need, join Ending Spending. Now it has come out that although he has amassed a fortune of over $1 billion and has repeatedly attacked Obama and his supposed socialism, he is asking the city of Chicago and the taxpayers for $300 million in taxes to renovate his business's stadium, Wrigley Field, which is almost 100 years old, so the family doesn't have to use their money and they can continue to make money once the stadium is renovated. This socialized capitalism will come from diverted amusement tax revenues. In other words, they will divert taxes from the sales of beer and peanuts. Joe Ricketts, you are not only trying to subvert our democracy with super PAC ads, but you are truly a hypocrite for decrying Obama and socialism while demanding the government give you $300 million in taxes from hardworking Americans to renovate your stadium that is wasteful and unnecessary. Contact Mayor Rahm Emanuel and tell him Joe Ricketts needs to pay for his stadium himself.